Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make rims change effect easy and quick in After Effects. First of all let's go to tracker and click on track camera. Once the analyzing is done, scroll your video and find some good spots on a wheel. For a better perspective select all of the points are on the wheel, then right click and select, create solid and camera. Once we have that tracked solid, we can bring our downloaded rim image. Now we have to mask out only rim, to mask I will use Mocha AE, if you don't have Mocha, you can use After Effects Ellipse Tool. In Mocha grab an Ellipse Tool and mask out the rim only. Once you are satisfied with the mask, click on save button and close Mocha AE. Expand matte now and click on apply matte. Link rim layer to a track solid and enable 3D on it. Toggle off track solid layer and let's adjust the rim size and position. Once you are done and rim is well tracked, we can make a rim fly in animation. Go a few frames forward and press P on your keyboard, then click on position stopwatch icon. Then go to very beginning of the rim layer and change position of it. Now let's select both keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor, right click here and make sure edit speed graph is selected, then make a smooth curve like in this video. Everything looks smooth to me. Now we can add cool effect something like smoke or dust once the rim hits the car. Scroll to the moment where the rim is on its place and let's add a smoke footage. I will leave a download link in the description for this one. Position it right where the rim is and then make sure smoke layer is below your rim layer. In my case it seems a bit slow, I will speed it up a bit. Right click on smoke layer, go to time and select, time stretch. I will set stretch factor to 65. That's better to me. I will add a bit of glow on a smoke layer, I will use a deep glow plugin, if you don't have it, make sure to like this video, follow me on Instagram and write me, I want deep glow and I will gift it to you. Also to thank you for your amazing support, I will give away my some other plugins as well. Change exposure to around 0.10, then expand tint and toggle it on. Change mode to soft light and play around with colors until it looks cool to you. I will bring down mix a bit and we are done with glow. Now let's change the rim on another wheel. Select your video and then click on 3D camera tracker to see tracking points. Select all points on rear rim, then right click and select, create solid. Toggle off track solid layer and duplicate your rim image. Move duplicated one above track solid. Make sure to set parent and link to none and disable 3D on duplicated rim layer. Now link it to a new track solid and enable 3D again. Press P on your keyboard now and click on stopwatch icon to remove keyframes, then right click on position and reset it to normal position. Adjust the rim's position and size until it looks realistic. And once it's tracked and you are happy with it, we can animate this rim as well. Press P to open position, go a few frames forward somewhere before front rim hits and click on position stopwatch icon. Then go to very beginning of rim layer and move rim's position out of frames. Now select both keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard, then go to graph editor and make the same curve we did to previous rim layer. Now duplicate smoke layer and move it below your second rim. Position it right when the rim hits the wheel and we are done. I will make the rear smoke a bit smaller. Lastly we can add shake effect, I will skip that part cause I have already made a shake tutorials. Also I have created 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description. Check how it looks like with my shake preset. Hope this video was helpful, thanks for watching and like the video please.